Protesters gathered outside the headquarters of Casa Latina, a Seattle nonprofit that provides employment, education, and other services to the city's immigrant population. We are here because the, in Casa Latina, they are a, a big problem. They're demanding the group do a better job of protecting its workers and the people it serves after a Casa Latina employee came forward with sexual misconduct allegations against one of her superiors. They deserve to be trading by the, by the right way. The woman, who we are not naming because she's an alleged victim, told King Five a male employee touched her inappropriately multiple times and sexually harassed her. She says she reported it to Casa Latina management and the Seattle Police Department, in part because she fears there may be other possible victims. SPD tells King Five it received two reports related to Casa Latina, but could not provide additional details because of the nature of the allegation. Casa Latina's executive director tells me they received a complaint in March from a staff member against another staff member. He said they investigated the claim very thoroughly, consulted with attorneys, and took action. He said in a statement, quote, Our participants are rightly concerned and upset that sexual harassment may have taken place at Casa Latina. I have shared with them as much as I am able, and unfortunately they are not satisfied with the outcome of this case, and they are expressing their frustration, which is their right. We don't know if the man accused of sexual misconduct still works at Casa Latina. I've reached out to him and I'm still waiting to hear back. In Seattle, Ted Land, King 5 News.